I'm going to show you how to put a field point onto an arrow. We'll need a head shaver. Um, and this is uh, 23 64 And you stick it in the long bladed end and just use it like a pencil sharpener. So that's shaved to the shape, and that's what it looks like when it's on. However, you need a bit of glue. So I use uh, 24 hour Araldite Super Strength, and for this purposes, we only squeeze out a little bit because I'm only going to do a couple of arrows. Make sure you get even amounts of the glue okay and you put the cap on the right way otherwise you glue the cap in place give it a good mix make it nice and even so it's, it's going to do the job Now you're going to end up with a bit of excess glue. Just need a rag and wipe it off. And there it is. You need to sit that aside for about 24 hours and that shouldn't come off. Okay, I'm going to attach one of these bodkins and you've got to put it on the same way for all of the arrows and I'll show you how I do that. So to actually get this shape, and it's not the same as a field point, so these are good for making the shape for these field points. However, these bodkin points are much shorter than what's required for a field point. So I'm going to use the tapering tool okay okay so that fits nicely onto that but if i get one of these you can see it's not so snug it's loose so what i need to do is with the coping saw take off about four mil I'm just going to clean that up with a tapering tool okay so you can see that's a nice snug fit okay I want to put these on with um, 24-hour aldite. So it's a two-part glue. So I'm going to squeeze it onto a clean surface. He says. mix too much here but you make sure you mix it nice and well and I'm just using a stick from the garden rather than wasting anything special so that's mixed up enough so We dip it in to the glue, not too much otherwise it'll just pop out 
Um, so we've got the glue on and then we'll put the head on. Now I've got to line this one of these pyramid all corners up with the cock shaft okay so that looking down the shaft that should line up with the cock feather okay and then we need to clean off the excess glue So that's ready to go. Just have to wait for the glue to dry. Yep. 